All right, everybody, before you watch this video, I need to sit down and talk to you guys. So the last video that you might have seen on my channel, I had left CJ. Um, I got a ton of hate for that video. A lot of people calling for my head, uh, not happy that I left CJ. CJ and I are good. We've sat down, we've talked about like Kendra, so where I'm coming from. Um, but I wanted to tell you guys that this video is going to explain a lot of that. So the footage that you are going to see at the beginning of this video was filmed last week. This was filmed two days prior to the last video that I posted. Um, I kept this footage for a little while because CJ and I were going through, we're trying to really dissect what happened, try to really like explore everything that happened before we decided to post it on the internet. But um, we've had a human element that whole entire night. Different things happening. We had an ice cream truck following us that you guys will see based off of whatever reason. I don't know why, but that is part of why I was so on edge two days later. The fact that there could have been humans nearby, again, was not something that I was dealing with anymore because I did not feel safe for me, for CJ, or anybody else. Um, CJ... CJ did not feel safe doing it alone by himself based off of footage that you guys have seen in his video that he posted just previously a couple hours before this one. If you guys didn't already, pause this video, go watch his, come back and watch mine. But yeah, so we did not feel safe the entire night because of what happened two days previ previously. So I don't feel great about it and I'm not feeling too great about what I'm doing right now. But to preempt what I'm about to do, I'm here alone at the same exact spot I ran out of last time. And I'm trying to catch whoever was out here messing with me and CJ. Um, it's about a week later. Sorry, it just looked like there's a flash out there. It's about a week later. Um, like I said, I am here alone. CJ is currently out of town this week. So I was like, I'm going to go try to catch these people were because I'm not cool with them messing with us anymore. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead. I'm just going to start this video with the footage, like I said, from a couple, like about eight, nine days ago. Uh, I'm going to start off with that. And then I want to pick up with this video afterwards. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for love and support. Uh, to all the people that are giving me hate, listen, it was a tough situation. CJ completely understood why I did it. Um, put yourself in my shoes. I don't think you would stay either. If I'm being completely honest, I don't think you would have. But anyway, so I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to kick off this video. But I just wanted to explain that before we got this video started. All right, what's up, everybody? This is a little bit of a different intro than I normally do. CJ and I have already been filming for his channel. Make sure if you haven't already, go watch the video link down below. Um, we just got back, and long story short, my whole car was ransacked. My knife was taken out. We don't know where this person could be. It's already has us on edge. We're about to try to go find him. I do have CJ walking around somewhere over here. He's scaring the yeah, shit out of me. Over here. There he like, there's 100% like, someone around here. Both of Dylan's doors were open and somebody ransacked his entire back seat. Like, I've, I've never felt more uneasy, especially when you said your knife's missing. So now I'm like, yeah. hey, there's some madman in the woods with a knife. Exactly. So, like I said, if you guys haven't already, Go watch CJ's video, link down below. It ties into everything here. Um, we're going to go try to see if we can find anybody because I'm pissed off right now. I'm very on edge, uneasy, so I'm hoping we can find this guy because I don't want just some random dude walking around with a knife. So anyway, make sure to like, subscribe, go over to CJ's video, make sure you like, subscribe if you aren't already, and yeah, we'll pick up in the next clip here. All right, and break. here's the part where we split off because our vehicles are parked here. Dylan is going to go across the way over here. And, uh, me, I'm, I'm going that way. I don't know why I'm going that way. It's creepy. Can't lie, Dylan's way is kind of creepy too. Dude. So, uh, good luck, have fun. Good luck, bud. Have fun. I'm going to do spirit talker, I guess.
All right, so I'm trying to get my camera to focus in. I might grab my bigger flashlight really quick too. Hang on. So yeah, I'm gonna grab my bigger flashlight really quick. All right, so I got my bigger flashlight now so I can actually see just a little bit more, so. What's that? Alright, I'm also start my spirit talker. I'll put spirit talker in my pocket. So hopefully you guys will still be able to hear it. Put it in my top pocket so hopefully we'll be able to hear. Alright. This is creepy. I do not like this. Especially the fact that somebody had broken into my car recently. It's any spirits that are out here. My name is Dylan. And I don't mean any harm. Obscure vision. Obscure vision. I'm just trying to get some answers out here I know that this is one of the most haunted forests in the world and there's such thing as the Jersey Devil a lot of paranormal activity you name it there's a lot of it out here so I'm just looking to get some answers from you so can you go ahead and make a sound for me I'm talking to this device in my pocket Lucille. Lucille? Nice to meet you, Lucille. My name is Dylan. Can you uh, go ahead and tell me what happened to you, Lucille? Ah, oh, that wind every time gets me. Sounds like a car coming. Is that CJ? CJ! What's happening to him? CJ! What? There's somebody down there? <sighs> you good? Can't breathe. Bro, my spirit talker just said can't breathe. Huh? My spirit talker just said can't breathe. Yeah, what the f was that? Dude, what the f is going on out here tonight? <laughs> I don't know. Get to a section back there, it's got all water. All water back there. Like two lanes. You can't go this way, you can't go that way. So I'm like, alright, no problem. I turn around and start walking back this way. Yeah. And I thought I heard something. I thought I heard a voice. So I turned around. 
I said hello. Immediately after I said hello. Dude, what is going on? Do you think it's a natural person? Do you think it might be paranormal? Like I don't, I don't know who it could be. We're in the middle of nowhere. There's no cars here. There, there's like no way. I mean, I don't know. That this could be a person. I'm like hypervalent right now. That was scary as hell. Dude, I can only imagine. I heard it and I thought it was you screaming. I mean, I might no. have just heard you screaming. What is that on the road? Crash. Oh, yeah. Crash? Yeah. My spirit talker said crash. Oh, crash. No, 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 buddy. This place is no joke. I mean, we're going, oh, I think it's just a piece of wood. Uh, we're going to every spot. And that lady. We're going to every spot in that lady's email. Dude. What if that's a trap? What? What if the email's a trap? How would she know what they were gonna come out here? What if she doesn't? What if like they're out here every single night just waiting for us to come? Some people got nothing better to do. Well, if that's the case, I say we get in the truck to go somewhere else. Like, uh, it's just boring. it's just a thought. I mean, like, who's said it's not like a group of people and they're disguising themselves as a quote unquote lady sending us an email. We just say it's not somebody with like ill intentions. All right, now you got me freaked out right now. Where did that noise come from? I have no idea. I'm tripping out right now. The hell was that? Stay close to the car. It literally just looked like something just moved down here. Something moved? Where? Like at the end of this curve. That's a light. Hang on. There's a light back there. There is. I can't see it on camera, but it's here. It, went it just went off, John. It was over to your right. What the hell is that? There's something somebody like walking through the woods. Walk through the woods like tapping sticks, like tick tick. Yeah. Tick tick. Why are those birds so stirred up back there? I don't know. Dude. And, and also, My how are they seeing it? Now? So they'll turn know. the flashlight on and turn it back off? Probably. I mean, they see lights, they'll probably turn them off. Most of the time, they probably have lights on until they see something, you know what I mean? Like... There's noises all around. Yeah, dude, there's... There's way too much going on. Sound like your car, bro. That was just a Was that your car line? I don't know. I don't think so. Because if it was my car line, it would have kept going on. No, it, something went beep. Beep. Yeah, I heard it. I said, if it's my car line, I think it would have went off. My phone just vibrated over there. 
Oh, so I left, left my book bag behind in the truck. So I got an air tag in there? Yeah. Okay. Open? If we go back and your bag's open. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm going, dude. I'm, that is the grand finale of a TJ's night here. <laughs> That's the fireworks off, folks, so I'm done. Dude. How far down that trail did you make? I was a pretty good way, and then I saw your light, and I was calling your name, but... I'm sorry, dude. That, that was... That was weird. It's a, I don't know if that was a scream I heard, or if I heard you scream afterwards, because I heard something, and I saw you running. I'm 99% sure. One of the lights, lights on your vehicle, or mine flashed, or there was somebody way off in the distance park that we can't see. I don't know. I mean, my car's still locked. We can see the security light flashing. Blonde hair. Blonde hair, as it said. Okay. Yeah. Don't it's, you look like you're about to go cut down a tree right now. <laughs> Dude, it's comfy. It's cozy. Okay, I'm not paying attention to that side. I'm paying attention to this side. Because this is where... This is where the noise Like, if that was not a human voice, yeah, I don't know what would. I don't know what would make that noise. If that was paranormal, that was some of the craziest paranormal evidence then. See, I just don't think the birds should be out at night, dude. That's not normal. No. When do you hear birds tweeting at night? Besides us on Twitter. Yeah. It's not called Twitter anymore, so you gotta call it X. What is that sort of tree? Is that light? Oh, it's a plane, I think. Oh, shit, yeah, I see that. What is that beep? I gotta go big. Bad. So. Dylan and I got to the middle of nowhere, literally. literally in the middle of nowhere, and there's a nice pull-off area. We're going down this like road right now that there's really not like much area to like turn around, but there's like a half lane. You have cell phone reception here? Apparently. I don't. I'm in SOS mode right now. I don't know uh, how I did. I thought it was on oh, one person do that search, so Al can still come through. So. I got SOS. Yeah. I got one bar, because I thought I was on, like, do not disturb or something like this. I don't like my no phone going off while filming. I don't know. But it is what it is. But we're, we pull, we pull it off, yeah. because what we're going to do... What? That makes no damn sense. What is that noise? What's that, what's that music? Where is that coming from? That's behind us. Definitely behind us. That's ice cream truck music, bro. That's ice cream truck music. Keep, keep shining your light down there. Keep shining your light down. Who the f*** brings the ice cream truck back here? I don't know. My spare phone said there's a group of us. There's a group of us? That's what you said? Yeah. Okay. Hang on. You can hear like the hum of it coming closer too. Yeah. It stopped. Wait, stop. I'm theoretically put this out there. It's 9 o'clock at night. What the f is the ice cream truck going back to? No cell phone know. service. There's no houses back here. No. Isn't it too cold for ice cream, too? Wait, it's like 30 <laughs> degrees outside. Need help. Need help. What if it's better for the ones that there's a group of people that need help and it's trying to lure us, like. 
an ice cream truck back, going. That's what I'm saying. Like they're playing it like it's a group of people like trying to kidnap lure us, us and, in and like, play with us or something. <laughs> I don't know. We already talked about earlier. Like coordinates said that quote unquote lady sent us. Seems like there's some people on the What if this isn't another trap? Uh uh bro. That's closer. That's close. I, I, am I hearing this correctly? Yeah. I, I say we just drive. I say we just drive this way. Yeah, I'm not waiting for an ice cream truck to come and murder us in the woods, though. No. And like on off, on off. Are we like going crazy? I I I hope I wake up and this is a dream because I'm calling you first thing. I'm like, yo, Dylan. <laughs> You're not gonna believe this. We were in the woods. There's ice cream truck in the middle of the damn pine barrens in bump nowhere. Neil. 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 I say we just keep driving this way because we can't turn around. Yeah. It's getting close. Ah. Uh -uh. Yes, I'm out. I don't care if that ice cream truck is the last person on earth. It's in the middle of the woods. I'm not. Here. I just don't get where an ice cream truck would even be coming from. Like, well, why is an ice cream truck back here? That's what I'm saying. Listen. There ain't no shh. Listen, there's a damn ice cream truck back here. I don't know if you guys could hear it that well. Um, that ice cream truck, I'm very confused. Like, what would it be doing back here? I'm almost thinking that literally somebody is toying with us and messing with us, and I don't like it. I don't know what the going on here tonight but this is not cool all right y'all so that light is very bright my god holy shit. Don't even be seeing stars for three days, son. we went about probably at least another four to five miles down the trail i didn't know this trail was this damn long I didn't either. but apparently i think this trail leads all the way to freaking cape may new jersey like it goes everywhere but anyway um we think we're kind of far enough away. We haven't heard anybody or anything. Um, so I decided, let's try to bring this investigation to a new level. And I'm going to do something really stupid. I'm going to go stand in the middle of the street. So hopefully no cars come or anything. Uh, yeah. and you, if you get smoked by an ice cream truck and die, <laughs> it was meant to be. It was meant to go this way, Dylan. Literally. I told Dylan, Literally. I was like, this is the dumbest idea ever. We're in the middle of nowhere. We just heard an ice cream truck about five miles ago. Yeah, let's just keep going forward and then pull over and hopefully they come back by. I'm not even hey. filming this shit so I can get my truck early and run. I'm, I, I told him, I'm telling everybody on, on the camera here, on, on, good old, on the good old YouTube, I am leaving if I hear that truck again. And uh, if he don't get in his car and, and come with me, that's on him. Listen, I'm a fat boy, so if I can run over by an ice cream truck, I couldn't think of a better way to go. It's meant to be, so, Yeah. So anyway, I'm going to put on these headphones. I'm going to go over here. We're going to do an Estes session. Uh, so yeah, I don't know what the hell to expect. So, But I will show you guys. This way you know that everything's legit. It's actually going through my ears. Let me pair to these really quick. Okay. I'm going to turn on my necrophonic. Bro, why am I so paranoid right now? <laughs> well, we just heard a damn ice cream truck in the middle. Yeah, you want to pull over like, here and play? Yeah, it's like cops give it a good eye over here with the headphones and shit. That's bad. All right, y'all. So it's gonna be up there. I didn't hear it's that loud, so I'm gonna go over here. And of course, the first thing I hear is leave. So. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Well, the ghosts are telling you, hey, Dylan, leave because there's an ice cream truck with an axe murderer in there who's gonna kill her. Exactly. So, all right. I can't hear. Okay. I'm letting all y'all know in the comment section. If we hear an ice cream truck, I'm gonna go tap him on the shoulder. I'm getting in my truck. I'm dead ass leaving. I'm not around this. I'm literally paranoid. Okay. Number one question I got: If there's any spirits around here, any dead people, or anything like that, where the hell did the ice cream truck go? And is it close by? Yes or no? Is there a truck or a, somebody close by us right now? Come see. Okay. Dylan just said come see. Uh, I'd rather not. So be nice if you can kind of tell me. Can you hear it? I cannot hear it, no. Watch out. Watch out for what? Does my friend need to watch out? Is there going to be like an ice cream truck running like 95 through here and smoke him? He's here. Oh, he's here. Look out. Play.
What do we need to be looking out for? He's coming. Okay, I understand he's coming, but like... Murder. Oh, that's, that's nice. That's the most amazing thing I've ever wanted to hear while standing in the middle of the woods with no cell phone reception. Is it like some evil clown that's gonna pop out of this ice cream truck and like stab us nine times and then like get back in the truck and roll? Like, how's this work? I just wanna prepare myself. Watch it. Watch what? What you say. Okay. Well, I got you. Huh? Repeat yourself? Walking. Okay, it actually sounds like there's somebody walking this way. Can you see me? No, but I can hear you walking. You'll learn. Okay, I'm more concerned about the ice cream truck right now. I think you're a ghost and you're just trying to intimidate me right now. Mafia. Here. Here where? Behind you. Behind me? What the f did I do? CJ. Oh, f you. Leave. I think that's probably a pretty good idea, honestly. You better watch out. I'm looking in 360 degree range. Not you. Oh, him? You want to do him to watch out? I can't lie. If you got smoked by an ice cream truck, that would be pretty damn good footage. Even though yeah. he is. Huh? Can you hear me? No, I cannot hear you. Coming. When you say they, how many people? I'd like to know how many times when we get stabbed. I mean, enough. Enough. Oh, enough to kill me? Okay, cool. You're next. Oh, who's next? Me or Dylan? Jacket. We, got, we both have jackets on, dumbass. You gotta be more specific than that. Road. Oh, my buddy's gonna get smoked by the ice cream truck in the road. That's nice. How wonderful. Should I tell him to move? Further in. Further in. In the middle. Well, he's definitely in the middle. Further. Who's driving this ice cream truck? Don't worry about it. Oh, oh. All right, this getting a little weird. I can't. Leave. I would love to leave, but my friend Dylan's in the middle of the road right now. I'm trying to talk to you. Truck. I can get my truck if you'd like, yeah. Music. That's, yes, we heard music earlier, yes. It's coming. Well, I don't hear it. I don't hear a truck, I don't hear music, I don't hear anything. Give it time. Okay, listen, hey. Hey. Dead ass, it sounds like a, a vehicle slowly moving. Oh, it's loud. Yeah, oh shit. Oh, oh, what the f is that? Yo, that's lights. It's like in the woods. That's lights in the woods, right? What is that?
，真係好高啊！That that Estes method was so weird. It was like so spot on. Really? Spot on, dude. Dude, spot on. Like I'm asking a question about the ice cream truck. If you get smoked by an ice cream truck, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like if, if I'm not gonna lie, if ice cream truck came around that corner and like yeeted you. Yeah. Oh yeah, you think it's yeah. funny? You think it would have been a good time? I mean, it would yeah. be funny, but it would it would be a little yeah. ironic. Wait. That's headlights. That's headlights. That's headlights. <laughs> Alright y'all, so like you saw in the beginning portion of this video, uh, I am here alone at the Pine Barrens. There is literally nothing but woods around me. A lot of noises. Okay, I don't know what that was. You guys probably couldn't hear that over the airplane, but yeah, so I'm actually here alone. Uh, my car's right over here. I just locked the door, so I don't want another repeat of what happened last week. Um, yeah, so I... I'm starting off at the spot that I last left CJ where he was camping. I want to investigate around here some more. I want to see if maybe there was somebody hiding out here. As creepy as that sounds. But anyway, so I'm just going to go ahead. I'm going to flip the camera around and we're going to go ahead and see if we can find anything. Alright, so there is the road. Here is all of the woods. And then back here is the spot he was actually camping in. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna open up Spear Talker. Alright, but anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna open up Spear Talker here. Let's see if we can get any kind of answers. I think I'm gonna go this way. To any spirits that are here right now. My name is Dylan. Joyce. Joyce. Nice to meet you, Joyce. As I say, my name is Dylan. Um, I was here a few times, but last week I was here with a friend and I got scared off and he ended up getting scared off after trying to camp here. So I was coming to try to get some answers. I was trying to see, was that you guys? Or is that something human? Alright, so... I think that's running water down there. You guys can probably hear that. Okay. Well, this is kind of like a dead end. I thought maybe this goes a little bit further. I thought maybe this would help me kind of find whoever I was looking for. Alright. I'm going to go back to the actual camping spot then. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Well, it's nice to meet you too. Can you go ahead and uh, tell me a little bit more about last week when I was here? I know you guys can see a little bit more. Can you tell me was it something paranormal messing with me or was it something human that was messing with me and my friend? So that's my car.
being out here alone is very unsettling. I don't know how CJ felt comfortable for so long to even try to sleep out here. Where are you from? Oh, that scared me. There's something like broken wood stuff up there in the tree. Almost looks like, like an old ladder. Where are you from? Well, I'm originally from New Jersey, but I live in Delaware now. Can you tell me where you're from? Like a little trail through here. I keep feeling like I'm hearing footsteps. I don't know if you guys can hear them or not, but there's definitely footsteps somewhere around here. He killed me. He killed you? I'm sorry to hear that. Can you tell me who killed you? Such a weird little area. I might try to walk down the bridge. See if I can find any answers. <sighs> this is kind of the moment sometimes where I do wish I had CJ. Growl. Here my... Growl. He said that you're gonna growl at me. Okay, yeah, these are the moments I wish I'd have CJ here because he likes to really ramp spirits up. And when he does, you never know what the hell you're gonna get. And uh, sometimes that's a good thing, sometimes that's a bad thing. What's that? I don't know what that is, something plastic. I don't know. Yeah, I'm like, I want to get some good answers here, but so far we're not quite getting anything. It's still early in the night, but that's why I wish I did have like a CJ to just start yelling like, hey, you stupid son of a bitch, why don't you come out and show yourself? Like, you know, like the normal typical CJ stuff. Um, but the rumors are false. The rumors are false. Okay, what does that mean? Can you explain that? But yeah, so like, I swear I wish I did have CJ sometimes. Even though I get so mad at him for doing that dumb shit, honestly, sometimes, I'm kind of impressed with some of the responses we get, so. Um, yes, yeah, so I can't really explain 
what's quite gonna happen without him here. Let's ramp him up, so. Me. Me? What do you mean the rumors are false about you? Can you explain that? Okay, so there's like, that over there is the trail that I went down last time and caught that screen. That's like another little trail that I don't know where it goes to. Let's kind of check this out really quick. Because there might be a chance that this like ties into where CJ was camping, maybe? He says my car. I mean, there's definitely a chance that whoever's messing with me and CJ just kind of walked right through here. That's pretty terrifying to think about, honestly. Can you confirm, was somebody out here last week messing with us? My name is Fred. Your name is Fred? Well, thank you, Fred, but can you tell me about that? Can you tell me about what we experienced last week? Between an ice cream truck, random lights. Peter. Hello? Peter. We're getting a lot of names, but not really a lot of answers. I'm pretty sure I just saw something down here. Wait, is that a light? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. I'm gonna turn off my light here for a second. Let me see if you guys can see that. There's like a... Let me turn on my light again really quick. There's literally a light down there. I'm trying to see if you guys can see it. It's like right through the trees. Maybe. Look, I'm here. There it is. There it is. Oh shit, that is definitely a light. Oh shit. Okay. Oh shit. That's definitely a light. Coming through the woods down there. Okay. Alright. Oh shit. What are they doing out here? I mean, they could be doing the same thing I'm doing, but like, what? I'm so far down here that usually you're not down here unless you're looking for no good. Or ghost. It's definitely light though. Okay. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to try to move out towards the street. So if I need to run, I can run. So look, I'm here as I saw that light. So is that trying to say it's paranormal or is it trying to say the, what is that down there? There's just something that just reflected way down there. I don't know where that just went. I really hope the camera just caught that. That was weird. Bernadette. Bernadette. Alright, so we're getting a lot of names. We're not getting a lot of answers. So this is the little bridge that we got to cross over to get to our spot. Um, why is my camera not focusing in? There we go. I don't know why my light keeps falling too every time I film here. 
I might start using my flashlight and take this light off. Hang on, guys. Let's see if this will be better. Let me see if this will be better. Maybe we'll be able to see a little bit more. There we go. But yeah, so this is the bridge. Are there any spirits down here by the water right now? Some graffiti on the sign, I wonder what that says. Shrimp. No idea what that other one says. It's not human. What's not human? Let us rest. Okay, that's what I'm trying to do. But I'm just trying to get some answers first. What the fuck was that? Alright. I really hope y'all heard that. It literally sounded like a stick breaking right up over here. Could just be the tree. I'm not chalking out to be paranormal. But it could have been like a branch hitting one of these signs or something. I don't know. I feel like I would have heard it splashing in the water, but... I'm not quite sure what the hell that was. Affect. Affect. Alright, I'm gonna keep walking this way a little bit. I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna start walking in this trail again. See if we capture anything crazy. My camera's already almost dead. So this is great. Candles. I don't see any candles. I just sound like somebody just shushed. I also saw a comment too about somebody saying that I place these markers on a tree. No, these are actual just markers that the forest people put up. So this way when you're exploring, you can kind of find your way back so you don't get lost. Uh, I do not come out here at all until it gets dark because I don't want to run into people and I don't want them to know what I'm doing. So, 
yeah, so whoever said that, sorry, nice try. They're all over the literal Pine Barrens, so they're all different colors. Aggressive. Aggressive. What's aggressive? Can you tell me? Vanished. Vanish. Are you saying that people have vanished through here? I feel like I'm like seeing something move down in here. I don't know. It literally just keeps looking like something's like moving down there. Man. Man? Yeah, I am a man. Is that noise? That is a literal phone ringtone that just went off. And it was close. Okay. Alright. And now, I don't know if you guys can see it reflecting off Sandra. the trees. Try Oh, it's very darker. But there are lights coming down the road. Some. All right. All right, I think we're good. I'm going to start heading back because I don't know what the f that ringtone was. I don't like that though. So I'm going to start heading back to my car. My camera battery's on anyway, so I have swap batteries. Um, but that's definitely a f***ing ringtone. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, okay, 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 oh shit, oh shit.
I don't know if you guys can see that, but that is headlights. Oh, 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 oh. All right, yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. This, I'm out of here. Nope, nope. This, this shit. Nope, 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 nope. All right. So, I don't know what the fuck is going on. But they're following me right now. I'm trying to get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, I'm fucked. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright, I just gotta go through it.